The structure of the face is made up of four major components skin, fat, muscle, and bone. The loss of volume in this substance contribute to symptoms of aging, such as wrinkles, smile line, and the change in the size of the cheeks and lips. As the elasticity of the skin decreases and the contraction of the face muscle increases, the skin and the face become sagging. We all have an idea about the dermal filler, as it is a medical procedure can help reduce these wrinkles, restore lost volume, and give us a younger appearance. With age, even faces that were previously considered symmetrical tend to deviate from the golden ratio. The golden ratio has been applied to facial beauty and adopted as a guideline for aesthetic treatment that allowing to restore our face proportion closer to our youthful ideal, improve the attractiveness, and rejuvenate older features. Follows Leonardo da Vinci mathematical principle of beauty and harmony. With time, our perception of beauty has changed. People were preferring the round face, full cheeks, large lips, and asking for smile line disappearing. This has a change with time. They become aware and the natural beauty is becoming more desirable. But unfortunately, these days what we consider beautiful and attractive is greatly influenced by the media. Before the advent of social media, magazines and movies were giving people an idea about beauty. With the spread of social media, Celebrities are being watched all the time. That creates a distorted perception and they can also act as their role models. The problem is, this may affect their self-confidence. We have to remember, every person has its own and unique beauty and the filler invented to correct and adjust the contour of the face, not to change our shape. We are noticing some exaggeration in the filler injection. The problem is, people are ignoring that the frequent use of the filler may change the shape of their faces, their smiles, without noticing. Taking the filler will go within six months, and this concept is wrong. The aesthetic evaluation of the face must first consider our goals. Do we want to reverse to our previous appearance or want a fresh appearance? Another significant consideration must be made here, including checking the skin quality, examine and taking the golden ratio measurement of our faces by caliber prior to the treatment, to determine the places that require injection and whether there is any imbalance or asymmetrical in our face. Using the right product is essential here to achieve the most desired results. Talking about the skin, I always prefer to work on strengthening and improving the skin quality before starting filler injection. By doing several treatment sessions that may include ready frequency microneedling, laser, chemical peel and other rejuvenation treatment. I'm doing that for best and better result as the skin plays a big role in our facial attractiveness. Filler side effects are classified either frequent or rare. A bruising and a swelling are common but temporarily and will disappear in all cases. Rare but serious side effects such as skin necrosis and blindness can occur. If vascular obstruction or occlusion happen accidentally by filler. And here is the importance of the doctor's experience and knowledge in dealing with this complication and their treatment in appearance status. These problems can be prevented by using an ultrasound technology. Used to examine the injection site, which aid in facial arterial mapping to avoid vascular occlusion. Visualize safe cannula or needle placement prior to injection. 
and confirm filler placement and vessel flow after. In case of vascular occlusion, also can help to allocate the occluded vessels and dissolve the filler. I believe the ultrasound will be breakthrough and an essential tool in cosmetic world. Remember, filler injection can make the facial contour perfect or it can make it worse. And always, your safety is a priority.